up guys today we're at veterans park let's do some uh, trout fishing yeah. took my car for service so uh, they gave me a loaner and uh, all I got was my rod some tackle and uh, I didn't bring a landing net so we're gonna try to make it work And uh, it's about 30 degrees right now and dropping. It's supposed to get to single digits tonight. It is cold. It's almost super cold. But uh, me and another dude's over there fishing, so I guess I'm not the only crazy one. <laughs> not too bad. Yeah, water clarity is definitely gone. But uh, Let's see what we can do. What I'm using today is just basically a uh, dropper rig and it's just sinker, uh, dropper knot, and a tiny little little hook. And I will be using I will be using these Polsky uh, fireballs or balls of fire and uh I've had great success with these, so hopefully today we could uh, get on some of them. First cast. I don't see any trout swimming around, so I don't know. But uh, we'll see. Is a trout yes I'm waiting all day for this <laughs> Trout of the year. Beautiful little guy. Let's let it go. Whew. That was well worth the wait. <laughs> That was my mistake. Yeah, there goes another one. Oh yeah. So yeah, this one a little bigger. So there's another one. Up here. That quick. Take, take the stuff already. And the wind seems to have picked up too, which sucks, but it was what it is.
Sign come out, new gloves. Oh, I got a big one. Oh, I got something big. Ooh. Oh, what is it? Oh, it's a pretty big trout. Oh, yeah. He took it all quiet, too. Oh, yes. Look at him. I want to see this guy up close. Can go down there. Oh, well, there he goes. <laughs> that was a fail. All right, guys, so we're back at Veterans Park. This is day two, trout fishing. And today is, sun's up today, but it is much, much colder than yesterday. And I got my fly rod today, so we'll give it a shot. But then uh, I looked over here and yesterday it wasn't ice, but today the shallow part over here is iced up. So I'm gonna try to see if I can find some spots that aren't iced up and uh, Try to do some fly fishing. There's a little bit of wind, but uh, if nothing works, then we'll go back to the uh, original plan of having uh, spinners and uh, Polsky little uh, viral balls. Let's see these little bluegills. Oh man, it's all iced up. Underneath the ice, there's blue little bluegills in here. Go to a spot where there's not too much wind. And, uh, let's get some fishing going. It is so cold today. It's it was in a single digits this morning, and uh, right now it's only about like 15 degrees. So it is super cold, and uh, it doesn't help now because the wind has picked up. And look at that ice. Oh man. It is way cold. I should tell you how cold it is. Yeah. It's icing up on the guide up here. There you go. Oh, well. So much for trying to fly fish. On the coldest day ever. So, fly fishing has failed me. Uh, the guys are. I snuck way too fast, so we're back to conventional and uh, still the same setup. Let's just drop her rig and uh, go to the dock now to see if there's any fish there. Another guy over there too, but I think he's afraid to come out the car because it's so damn cold. And I'll be using the uh, Polsky fire old balls again in Oklahoma is that like it doesn't get cold enough to where the ice gets thick enough so you can ice fish oh I see the trout they're in there yes that gives me high hopes so uh, I just seen one swimming around time to break out the good old oh Balls of oh, fire. And it looks like there's more than a couple of swimming around. So, let's see if we can get something. I don't know, but I'm on a fish. Uh. <laughs> Mr. Bluegill. He didn't even.
All that matters is that it's going out. This blows off first. It's not a trowel, but it definitely took it. It's a pretty uh, good size one too. Oh shoot. He's peeing. So they're still feeding. There he is. Something in a light shot. Really nice little bluegills. Here you go, wrong species. Yeah, I think I'm gonna start holding my rod because uh, this was happening last time. <clears throat> I'll throw it out there and I'll just leave it and the fish will take and I, would, I don't even know because they're so small. They're, they're not moving my rod around. They're not carrying it around and by the time I know it, I have a fish on. So it was good to see good to know that uh at least the bluegills like salmon eggs too multi species uh catching here with this thing put my gloves back on before we cast it out oh, we're not skunking out today one in the books. All right. That means there's more over there. It's probably a deeper part. I really don't like setting the fishing pole or my fishing rod down too when I fish. I'm more of a action Jackson type dude where I like to feel the hits. I like to feel all the bumps, uh, everything that's happening down below. Uh, I don't know, I guess I got it from like bass fishing. Kind of gives you a good map of how the bottom is and uh, what you need to change, what they're hitting on, how they're hitting it. And this is kind of just, oh, here goes another one. There goes, there goes one. Yeah. Felt that one. Oh, it's a trout. Yeah. There you go. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, don't. All right. So they're probably over there in the deeper part. And I didn't bring my freaking landing net. So let's try to land him somewhere over there. Oh, man. He's pretty good size, too. Good sized trout. Beautiful looking fish. Got all the nice colors. And I hate to let him go up here, but that's how we gotta do it. We're controlling the, the barbless hooks makes uh, taking the hook out way easier. So I think they're out here, casting it back out here. Hopefully I can get another one. Something keeps jumping up there. I'm gonna have to catch him. I'm almost kind of thinking all the big ones are gone already. Like, oh, there's something. Take it. There you go. There's another one. Oh, he came off. <laughs> came off. Barbless. Well, 
That just means I gotta put more pressure on them. That didn't take long at all. So we get another one. Picked it up pretty fast there. Picked it up. Oh, there goes another one. Here it goes. Oh, there it goes. Yeah. Put more pressure on this guy. Yeah. Come on, little dude. Much bigger than the last one. And uh, looks about the same size as the last one I pulled in. And land them over here again. Man, they're just so beautiful. Okay. I have no gloves on, so. They are loving the balls of fire. They are loving the balls of fire. And here is second fish of the day, or third actually, with the little bluegill. Beautiful, beautiful fish. <sighs> but let's cast back out. Slow down. Maybe I should throw them. Oh, there. every time I say that, there it goes. There goes one. Oh yeah. Man, that's a good size one. Oh. Marvelous hook issues. Let's see if we can limit out two more. And that is our limit. If we're keeping, let's see if we can limit out today. It up, pick it up again. There he goes. Oh man, he played me. My reaction is too slow. He got me pretty good. Oh no, sun going down too fast. Come on. Hands freezing too. <laughs> oh, some something's got it. Come on. So cold, my hands are getting red now. <laughs> oh, here's one. Oh, yeah, here he is. 
I can bring him in. That's five. Oh, little jumper. Oh, he jumped onto the ice. Land him in our landing station over here. Please. Yeah. Six. 